did, did I not say if you were active with this person in the bedroom to go get tested? I literally said it. Y'all gonna realize I'm a psychic for real. This goes back to my great grandmother. She was a tarot reader. She was also a ginger. <laughs> she was a natural ginger. <laughs> I don't know why that that matters, but anyhow, yeah, bad health for some of you. Oh my God, gift and bad health, Virgo. Be careful. For some of you, this person wants you in the bedroom so they can give you the gift that they have. I'm gonna spell it out, okay? It's it's E S C O R T. Like for some of you, that's what this person was doing. I'm just gonna say it. And they were doing it with this karmic, and the two of them could have been meeting up with an Yeah, poverty. You see, they're broke. They're broke, Virgo. They have nothing. They have nothing. Wow, this is <laughs> this is karma. If this isn't karma, then I don't know what is. They're coming back to you broke, empty-handed, they have nothing. Casper the Ghost is coming back. Casper the Ghost, Virgo. There's something here that they did, and they don't want you to find out. Okay, the cleanup. I'm, I'm noticing that broom. It's like they want to sweep it, you know, sweep it under the rug. They want to siphon your energy, Virgo, because they feel like you have good luck. All right, Virgo, how are you? Welcome back to the channel. Starcy Zayed here. If you're new, make sure to subscribe and join the Soul Tribe. We're gonna read for you guys, okay? This is whatever comes up. It is a general read, so take what resonates and leave what doesn't behind. Cross watchers are welcome. This message is also timeless. Personal reads are in the late tree link in the description box below. I wanna thank everyone for all the support. I'm gonna fall that out of the way. We're gonna get started. Thank you so much, angels, ancestors, spirit guys, universe. The light of beings, ancient ancestors, elders. Guidance and three for my Virgos. What messages do you have for us? Truly grateful for your divine guidance and celestial lights. Okay. Let's see here. We have Gemini. Mercury energy. This is the lovers. And the magician. Then you have number seven here. The chariot. Cancer energy. The moon. Then you have the moon again, right? So we're seeing the strong energy here of the moon. Let me take this jacket off because I feel like things are about to get really serious in this read. I feel there is an unexpected confession coming from someone. And I want to see what we get here with the Oracle. Yeah, it's like you're going to have to make a decision here, I'm saying. <clears throat> Alien. And what do we have? What do we have for my Virgos? Rare gift. So you have something beautiful to share to the world. You're sharing it right now. Look, love offers there. Good health. A lot of you are going to go vegetarian, vegan, sadness. I'm noticing the heart here. So it's almost like this energy of heartbreak. Somebody here is getting heartbroken. Dice. So, somebody here. Why Why does this message always come up in your reads? It's like somebody here risked it all for an HOE or something. Ghosting. So somebody that ghosted you and broke your heart, they want to come back. Forns, yeah, this was really painful. Isolation, yeah, they left you completely alone. This, So this is your re. Casper the Ghost is coming back. Casper the Ghost, Virgo. Yeah, Fragmented is there. The picture is incomplete. Like, they feel like they have unfinished business with you. Divine Timing is there. They feel like you guys have, like, something special between the two of you. Trial and error, they want to try again. But you see, there's a third party. There's literally a third party. Marriage. They could be married to this third party or engaged to this third party. Online. Oh god. Clean up. The pat this person's trying to destroy evidence. Virgo. 
Yeah, soulmates is there. Yeah, this is like a soulmate, twin flame, birth. They want to have this brand new beginning. Fluidity. This person could be like bisexual or pansexual. Virgo. And you see, I feel like you cut all ties to the past, a lot of you. But it's like this person is still going to try. The issue that I'm seeing is this individual is trying to... It's like they're trying to destroy the evidence. There's something here that they did and they don't want you to find out. Okay, the cleanup. I'm, I'm noticing that broom. It's like they want to sweep it, you know, sweep it under the rug. I feel like this third party knows... And it could be several third party, you know, it could be, it could be that this person's friends are their third parties. You know what I get? I'm hearing audio recording. I'm also hearing videos, photos. So there could be something here that's getting leaked on the internet. Okay, this person could be getting put on blast is what I'm getting here. And your view, your view, like how you view them is going to change. Pink diamond, luck. They don't happiness. This person doesn't want you to look at them. They they don't want you to think that they're a monster. You know what this this is giving me like Beauty and the Beast. Like that's what it's giving me. Yeah, hot mess. Like they're stressed out about this because they lightning. They got the tower. They got the tower brick wall. Somebody here risked it all. Yeah, mountain. And, and you know what they're doing? Yeah, snake, mountain, stepping stone. Y'all need to be careful with this energy. This energy doesn't want you to know the truth. This energy is like trying to like trying to push this forward, but it's like they don't want you to know the truth. And the reason they don't want you to know the truth is because they feel like if you know the truth that you won't want to marry them later down the line. They see you as the one that they're going to settle down with, but they did stuff. They did some stuff, so let's get into it. Let's see here. What did this person do? What did this person do, spirit? Temperance and death. Whatever they did, spirit was not happy. <clears throat> spirit still is not happy with this person. Six of Cups. King of Wands. Look, the tower. They are getting their karma. Holy crap, are they getting their karma? They don't even know which direction to go through. This 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 individual, this could be your twin flame or your soulmate, um, your divine counterpart, but they really they messed with the wrong <laughs> They messed with the wrong S H I T. Let's just put it that way. Yeah, Temperance is there. They're going to try to come in towards the end of December, early January for a lot of you. Okay, expect communication from this individual. Queen of Pentacles. Yeah, I'm hearing heartfelt confession. Nine of Wands. And the Empress. Wow. This individual sees you as having the bag. They see you as having uh, stability, so they want to come in. They, they want some of that. They want some of that. Yeah, Seven of Pentacles in reverse, but they're not ready for a commitment. Yeah, Empress. This person is not ready for commitment. Nine of Pentacles. Seven of Wands. The future shows you rejecting them. Why is Virgo rejecting this person? Five of Swords, because you still feel like they're playing games. Five of Swords in death. For some, for some of you, this person, they, they went way too far. Like, they went way too far. They took it way too far. Yeah, four of wands. Look, I'm just going to be honest. For some of you, there is no saving this. Like, I, I really feel like there's no saving. Like, I feel like you would have to overlook a lot. I feel like this person is broke. They're broke. They don't have uh, anything. Um, they could have gotten laid off. So it's like they're looking at you. Literally, look at this. They're, they're lo looking at you as like Queen of Pentacles, the Empress, Nine of Pentacles. They see you as rich, wealthy, someone that has money, tons of money. Like that's how they're seeing you. And now they want to come in. They see you have the bag or you're getting the bag.
the sun in reverse. So something here is hidden. Something here is hidden in the dark. Yeah, judgment. This could be a Leo, a Scorpio, Cancer, Gemini. But I'm getting strong Scorpio. Look, they're not going to tell you that they're broke. Some of you, they will. For others, they're trying to decide if they want to tell you that or not. They're coming back to you broke, empty-handed. They have nothing. They don't have nothing. High Priestess almost... Oh, yeah, that's basically in reverse. High Priestess in reverse is secrets. Six of Pentacles. They want you to give them money. They want money. Like, I don't know how else to, to spin the read. This person wants money. Yeah, the star... Th this person... They want money, S-E-X. But they don't want a commitment. The star and the higher fan, that's too... Like, you're you're the new, and this individual represents the old. That's the thing. You represent the new era, right? The age of Aquarius. But this individual is still stuck in, like, the age of Pisces. You know, no offense to Pisces or Aquarius, right? But it's like the age of Aquarius is set. To bring in great transformation on this planet. But that transformation also comes from us. This is not going to work because this individual is too stubborn and set in their ways. And they're, they're not wanting to change. Or they're struggling with change. So they're not ready for this type of commitment. They're not ready for this high level connection with you. Um, also, they they got some financial issues going on. The Six of One... Yeah, they... Look, and the Ace of Pentacles, Spirit's literally saying yes. This individual feels like if they get involved with you, that their bad karma will automatically be deleted. This person feels like they have bad karma for how they did you in the past, for ghosting you, for breaking your heart. So they feel like if they get back with you, they give you good SEX, you know, that this bad karma will go away and they'll finally be able to get the abundance. They also feel like for some of you that, you know, if they just apologize to you, that the bad karma will go away, but that's not how it works. You see, if they're your divine counterpart, there's certain things that they can't do to you because then they face consequences and they cross the line. They cross the line. What is it that they did? They're trying to do spell work to, to keep you, to, to keep this going. What, what, what is it that they did? The two of wands, they couldn't make a decision. They basically dragged this out. Seven of Swords. Oh, they were doing, they were driving. Virgo, this person, I'm telling you, this person was driving around doing some shady SHIT. I'm hearing delivery driver, so they could have told you that they were a delivery driver, but I, I don't know about all that. Yeah, Page of Wands, it seems to me, like, especially if this is a guy, it seems to me like he was using the magic wand, okay? If you, if you get what I'm saying. King of Swords, Eight of Swords. Ugh. Why is this coming up in Virgo's read? Why is this coming up? King of Swords, Ace of Swords. Because Spirit wants to wants you to know the truth. Wants you to be aware of what's headed your way. You know, this individual's intentions. Some of you have not heard from this person in months. For others, it's been three years. Okay, I heard three years. So, oh, for some of you, it's been ten years. So, you know, others it's been seven, but it's like, this individual is coming back in, but just know the truth of the situation. They do not have money, or they're in, you know, they're they're up to their eyeballs in debt, okay? They just have a lot of drama going on, and it's like they're looking to get into your good energy, and then they can siphon and harvest your energy, and then they're hoping to be able to turn, you know... Uh, turn the ship around. Yeah, the strength card is there. This could be a Leo. You know what this is? They want to siphon your energy, Virgo, because they feel like you have good luck. That's why that luck card came out. And look what it says. Good fortune, positive change, fulfilled wishes, unexpected happiness. They feel like you have all the blessings. So if they can get into your energy... They feel like if they can get into your energy for a little bit, have SEX with you, absorb your energy. This is this is like a demon. Y'all, I'm sorry, but this is a de this individual is possessed with a demon. And like there's still a third party. Knight of Cups, yeah, they're gonna make that offer. 
they're not gonna tell a lot of you if if they if they do not tell you the truth about their financial situation y'all need to y'all need to be careful with this person i'm being serious because it seems to me like there's a entity that's attached to them is there there's some sort of demonic force something here something nasty yeah eight of wands you see spirit is saying yes and the hierophant why is this hierophant coming out this this is the second time this could be a taurus or the third party's a taurus what is this hierophant the lovers and the knight of swords They see you as the one that they want to marry. They 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 want to marry you. They see you as the one that they're gonna marry. But the five of pentacles, they're they're broke. They're feeling left out in the cold, embarrassed, ashamed. What what did this person do? What did this person do? Four of Swords, the Tower. I really hope, okay, that. Like, if you look, I'm gonna be serious. I'm gonna be serious. Some of you, like, if you're resonating with this and you were active with this individual, I'm talking about SEX, please get tested, okay? Get tested because this is giving me an energy like this individual had a raging SEX addiction from the beginning. Like, they were meeting up with different people, doing stuff, and it could be that there are photos and videos of this, or, or somebody was secretly recording them, and now they're holding it as blackmail. For a lot of you, this person is also secretly bisexual, okay? So there was some same-sex, or, you know, if you guys are both same-sex, then it, there could have been, like, some hetero stuff going on where they were doing stuff with the opposite sex, okay? And there's, like, video proof of this. <sighs> Yeah, this is like, and this individual could have, for some, I'm going to spell it out, okay, it's it's E-S-C-O-R-T, like for some of you, that's what this person was doing, I'm just going to say it, and they were doing it with this karmic, and the two of them could have been meeting up with an older person, okay, I'm not going to go any further, but yeah, you're about to find out the truth. I, I suppose you're 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 about to find out the truth because this this is what and literally I literally opened this deck and marriage is gonna be at the bottom. You see, they want marriage with you, but they don't want you to know the truth because they feel like if you know the truth, you're not gonna want to marry them when they do come in and bring you this offer. You see, that this is what I'm saying. A gift is there, so they could have a, an engagement ring. They could have an engagement ring. What did I say? Did I, did I not say if you were active with this person in the bedroom to go get tested? I literally said it. Y'all are going to realize I'm a psychic for real. This goes back to my great grandmother. She was a tarot reader. She was also a ginger. <laughs> she was a natural ginger. <laughs> I don't know why that, that matters. But anyhow, yeah, bad health for some of you. Oh my god, gift and bad health. Virgo, be careful. For some of you, this person wants you in the bedroom so they can give you the gift that they have. Do you get what I'm saying? Do you understand? Some of you need to block. Block, don't even look back. Don't don't even look back. Look, Judication. I'm telling you, this individual was doing stuff that's shady. They want to change their life, but they, you know, and if it's not, they could have, a, you know, an STD that's antibiotic resistant or, or, or is really like they're struggling to get rid of it. They're struggling. They're, 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 they've been struggling to get rid of this. Yeah. Poverty. You see, they're broke. They're broke, Virgo. They have nothing. They have nothing. Wow. This is, this is karma. If this isn't karma, then I don't know what is. But what did I tell y'all? Do not sleep with this person under any circumstances. If this read resonates at all, Virgo, do not do it. Five seconds of pleasure is not worth it. It's not. There was that one dude, right? He thought it was cool. 
to go sleep around. And he was getting tested too. He was getting checked and everything came back until he ended up having to go to the hospital and he was dying on the hospital bed. And I'm not trying to scare people, but he died. He, you know, he, it was like one day he was good. The next day it hit him. It finally caught up. Sometimes these things don't show up in these tests. Before it's too late, you know, it's, it's like finding cancer really late. Yeah, toil and labor. This individual is working, slaving away. They're exhausted. They are exhausted. This individual did this to themselves. They, they destroyed themselves. They, they, they did not love themselves and value themselves. That's why they avoided you. That's why they ran from you. That's why they ghosted you. You were ready to give them unconditional love, and, and they took that and ran. Now they want to come in after they're, they, you know. And this is serious. Like, they want to give you, I can't make it, I can't twist it any other way. Bad health and gift. The Four of Swords, aka a bed. Come on now. I can't twist this any other way. This is why I do what I do. This is why I show up here. Because this individual, that's why the King of Swords and the Ace of Swords. This is you. This is you, Virgo, and you deserve to know the truth. So that is your read. That is what I have for you. I hope you enjoyed this. I wish you the best of luck, and I wish you love and light. Take care.